I'm liking these screaming goats, or goats in general. But I wasn't content just to watch them. I had to share them. And in this case, I shared them with my kids. This is what happened the first time they saw them. Start from the beginning. <laughs> so why did I want to share these, these, this goat video? Is it that I wanted to see it again? No, I wanted to see the looks on their faces and hear their peals of laughter. Why do we want to share these crazy, funny goat videos or, or just funny videos in general or funny gifs and clips and memes? And I, yes, people share a lot of very serious stuff too. They do, they do. But a lot of what we share, and we have the data to show it, a lot of what we share is this funny laugh out loud stuff. Why? I'll tell you why. It's not just that we want to show off and say, I saw it first. There is a bit of that, but it goes deeper than that. On one level, we want to share these funny videos because we want to show the world that we're full of life and happiness and sense of humor. But on an even deeper level, we want to share these funny gifts and clips and memes because we want others to experience this happiness with us. In fact, we get a rush of pleasure in knowing that other other people experience this, experience this happiness and pleasure with us. Are we being altruistic? No. We're hardwired to want to do this. Take a look at this. You see, from our very earliest days, from our first few months of life, we learn that by offering others happiness, we get that much more in return. Our first emotional response, our first emotional gift of happiness is the smile. Donald Winnicott calls it the social smile. And what happens when babies smile at their mothers? What happens? The mother smiles back, and this baby feels a rush of pleasure. Right, because he, he or she knows that she's loved. In fact, there's a lot of evidence to show that when babies start smiling like this, the mother-baby bond escalates. By the way, Stephen Johnson just came out with a book where he talks about tickling. Now, we've been tickling for eons and how even chimps tickle their young, right? Seriously, because they want to evoke this laughter, this coming out of the gut laughter because they know it connects them with their young. Right? And this extends to our larger social network as well. We learned that by offering others happiness, others this kind of sense of joy, we get that much more in return because we feel bonded to them. So when we share a funny video or a clip or a meme, we're not just sharing it, we are sharing in it. And we are not just a consumer of this energy, we are now a provider of it too, constantly fueling this connection, this what we call energy exchange that reminds us that we're connected to others, right? When I send a video to you, I'm reminded that you're gonna laugh and you're gonna like, you're gonna feel that much more connected to me. And in the end of the day, I feel that to you and to you and to you, I matter.